7 a.m. in the morning, that's where it all starts for ferocious cambosis. The hard work, the dedication, the sacrifice and belief. We're out on the road work, we're putting 10 kilometers in, in 10 degree cold, out at Canola Beach. Once we finish our road work, I'm on the beach, I'm doing my plyometric, my ladders, getting the legs nice and strong for the fights, my shadow boxing, a couple things go through my head when I push through that pain. My baby girl, my world title, and making all the fans proud. For a supreme athlete like myself, breakfast is the key after a big session. Morning breakfast consists of rolled oats, almond milk, strawberries, banana, that give me real good energy through the day. Eggs for my protein after a big session. And of course my protein shake from True Protein. The body's sore, but the mind's strong. I've got the world title in sights, something that I've dreamed on from a young kid. I'm hungry, I'm dedicated. And I put my body through hell to get what I want. Today's strength conditioning session consisted of kettlebells and airdyne circuits. As you can see, we do kettlebells with doubles, not singles, to make, maximize the body with full strength so I can knock out all of my opponents. After an intense session, I'm having my family time. I'm transferring from fighter to family man. I got my little baby girl who was just born three weeks ago, and she's a real motivation for me now. I've got two goals in my life. That's a world title and giving her the best life. Session two is complete. Now it's time to put some good food back into the system and spend some quality time with my family. I've got the inspiration for my little girl. I've got my partner cooking in the kitchen for me, keeping me healthy. Today consisted of healthy rye bread, which is a complex carb, avocado for my good fats to keep me going, keep me burning, and turkey, one of the leanest meats that you can get. I'm inspired by my family, and my family keeps me going. My little girl is what I do it for. And my family is everything for me now. And it's inspired me so much, especially in my last two fights against Ogilvy and Camille Bala. These guys standing in front of me, it's kill or be killed. You know, they're doing it for their family, while I'm doing it for my family. I've got my little girl to provide for now. I've got to put food on my table. And that's what inspires me, that's what motivates me. That's why I work so hard for this, for this, re for this reason. Not only to capture my world title, but to provide for my little daughter and for my family. Session three, we're in the boxing gym. We're grinding away, putting in solid amounts of work. I'm focusing on perfecting my craft, my skill, I'm feeling strong. There's nothing in my path that can stop me. It's kill or be killed. I'm focused on, on one thing, and that's capturing that world title. We start off obviously with our, with our warm up, and then we go to our shadow boxing, perfecting that skill, movement, sharp movements, sharp hands, defense work, footwork. Then we move on to our, our pad work. Gary St. Clair, former world champ, is putting me through the pad work, the combinations, the techniques, the movements. He's added a lot to my game now. The gym's got a great vibe. Everyone's working hard, and I'm the leader of the pack. We've got Australia's hardest working athlete right there in the flesh. I'm moving well, I'm feeling fresh, even after putting two big sessions in before that. Everyone's got their eyes on, on the champ, ferocious cambosis. Once we finish our pad work, we're straight on the bag. We don't stop, we get hungrier, day in, day out. I'm on the bag, I'm sweating, putting in that grind, getting in the bag fast, I'm hitting it with intensity, with ferocity. That's why they call me ferocious. Once we finish our bag work, we jump on the speed ball, that precision, that precision power to, to knock our opponents out. Once we finish on the speed ball, we're moving into, into uh, some backwards movements on the treadmill. We do a whole 10 minutes non-stop. The legs are already sore from running in the morning, from a kettlebell circuit during the day. We don't stop. On this side, Team Ferocious side, it's all day, all day growing. When you become the, the number one division, the number seven in the world, that's the focus of just non-stop work. Inspiration from myself, that's what I create inspiration from. Not only my family, but for myself, how hard I work. When you, when you work this hard, you can be as confident as you want. You can be as cocky and brash as you want. Just come up spying one of, one of the all-time greats, Manny Pacquiao. You're not the Australian champion, not the number one division, not the number seven in the world, but I am. I do it for my ferocious fans. I do it for my team, for the Australian public, for the Greek public, for the whole world that's behind me, Team Ferocious. Boom! <laughs>